Mr. Speaker, a recent study from the University of Calgary School of Public Policy concluded that Alberta's new royalty framework is making, get this, Alberta more competitive on the energy market than other jurisdictions in Canada, in particular our neighbours in British Columbia and Saskatchewan. To the Minister of Energy, while this is great news for companies, my constituents and everyday shop floor Albertans want to know, how will they see the benefits of this new framework? Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, certainly, uh, the member is correct. Jack Mintz uh, on Monday wrote that our new royalty framework will make Alberta significantly more attractive for investment. He continued to say that uh, Alberta is indeed more competitive than British Columbia, Saskatchewan, and many of the oil producing states in the United States. Um, this is going to attract investment in Alberta, and it's going to help fund the health care and the, and the education systems that all of us enjoy and want. Both sides of the House, please keep the volume down. Second, first supplemental. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Given that the study did not factor in the carbon price, the residents of Calgary Curry want to know if the same minister can tell Albertans if and how the carbon price will impact the implementation of the new royalty framework. Honourable Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, the member is correct that Mr. Mintz's analysis did not include uh, the carbon price. However, we have exempted on-site combustion of fuel at traditional oil and gas wells from the carbon for the next five years from the carbon levy. Uh, this is going to allow companies to adapt and uh, address methane emissions, and uh, it will encourage investment in technology to do this, something that which will be helpful to the midstream and downstream sector. Second supplemental. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thanks to the Minister for the answer. Can the Minister inform Albertans on the royalty programs that will come into effect in the new year? Honourable Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Indeed, uh, the new royalty framework takes place uh, beginning January 1st. We have two, uh, enhanced hydro, hydro, two programs, Enhanced Hydro Cover hydrocarbon recovery program and emerging resources programs. Those are for those harder to get resources, so it's a bit of a royalty break. It's going to bring out more drilling in those areas, and these are going to allow companies some uh, assistance in ac accessing harder to get resources. This is a win-win-win, Mr. Speaker, for, for industry. It's a win for investors, and absolutely it's a win for Albertans who are the owners of the resource.